socialism in europe and the russian revolution the russian revolution changed society differently and raised the question of economic equality and the well-being of workers and peasants this chapter unfolds the topics such as the changes initiated by the new soviet government industrialization and mechanization of agricultural rights of the citizens etc so let's begin with the age of social change after the revolution individual rights and social power begin to be discussed in many parts of the world including europe and asia colonial development reshaped ideas of societal change but everyone was not in favor of the complete transformation of society through the revolution in russia socialism became one of the most significant and powerful ideas to shape society in the 20th century liberals radicals and conservatives liberals wanted a nation that tolerated all religions they opposed the uncontrolled power of dynastic rules and argued for a representative elected parliamentary government subject to laws interpreted by a well trained judiciary that was independent of rulers and the officials they wanted a government based on the majority of a country's population conservatives after the 19th century accepted changes but also believed the past needed to be respected and change should begin slowly industrial society and social change industrial revolution led to changes in social and economic life new cities came up and newly industrialized regions developed men women and children came to factories in search of work but unfortunately working hours were long and wages were poor there was unemployment during the time of low demand for industrial goods liberals and radicals made wealth through trade or industrial ventures according to them society can be developed in freedom of individuals was ensured if the poor could labor and those with capital could operate without restraint in france italy germany and russia revolutionaries overthrew existing monarchs nationalists talked of revolutions to create nations with equal rights the coming of socialism to europe socialism was a well known body of ideas by the mid 19th century in europe socialists were against private property and saw it as the root of all social ills of the time they wanted to change it and campaigned for it robert owen 1771 to 1858 sought to build a corporative community called new harmony in indiana usa louis blanc 1813 to 1882 wanted the government to encourage corporatives and replace capitalist enterprises karl marx 1818 to 1883 and frederick engels 1820 to 1895 added other ideas to this body of arguments according to marx industrial society was capitalist who owned the capital invested in factories and the profit of capitalists was produced by the workers capitalism and the rule of private property were overthrown marx believed that a communist society was the natural society of the future was there any support for socialism by the 1870s socialist ideas spread through europe and they were formed an international body namely the second international associations were formed by workers in germany and england to fight for better living and working conditions the labor party and the socialist party were formed by the socialists and trade unionists in the 1905 so we have reached the end of our discussion hope you found that helpful now you can visit edurev to attempt the respective test so as to check your understanding of the topic you can also find more amazing content on other subjects like maths and science and what not so what are you waiting for go and check it out also 
स्टे ट्यून फॉर मोर अमेजिंग वीडियोज थैंक यू